Welcome back everyone. Today we have another Destiny 2 video featuring a solo flawless master completion of the Witch Queen campaign mission, The Arrival. This took a lot of attempts. I hope you enjoy. I thought I'd throw a little bit of commentary over the top of this run so you get a bit of an idea of what's actually happening here. At the moment the Light Bearer Knight is in his overcharge ability where he throws shields around and then Master these will one hit you. So I'm just hiding out of position until I hear the sound cue. But he's changing back. About to go now. There it is. So, a couple of Storm Chaser hits. He doesn't do too much damage in this mode. You can take a couple of those hits before going down. That ghost helping the hive. We have to stop its ghost. There's no other way. That thing is not like me. You see that, right? Okay, three more mini bosses. I. I can't believe As you this. see at the bottom right corner, I'm about 28 minutes into this run at the moment, we and have I've wiped in this fight on five separate occasions, oh, which is about two and a half hours worth of you. work wasted in this fight previously. That of course doesn't count the around 15 to 20 runs that I did that didn't get anywhere near this far. The Titan build that I'm using relies on me hitting hammer throws to be able to heal. If I don't hit hammer throws and kill enemies with the hammer, I don't get any healing, so missing hammers is basically a death sentence with as many mobs around. Let's take a bit of damage off this guy. Auto run to break his overshield. A couple of hammers while he's stunned. There's one. Give it a go. This next mini boss is the easiest of the three, as he's solar and I'm throwing solar hammers, so he's easy to kill. He usually comes from the left, but he didn't. Uh, miss a hammer here. Almost died because of it, but managed to hit another one. See the boss up top, throw a hammer for him, missed that one as well. Thank god it's a solar shield, so he died when I hit that last hammer and I got some health back, otherwise I would have wiped right there. Here I just try and clear out the last couple of ads before the final boss, which is the one that's absolutely wrecked me the last few times I've attempted this. You leave any of the ads up, you can be uh, killed from range, and it's pretty upsetting once you've been running for 30 minutes to get to this point. So I'm trying to clear all the ads first before depositing. Now I found you can't just kill this guy with uh, using your super, but you can use super to clear a bunch of the ads that are nearby what I'm doing right now. In a couple of runs I ran up and threw hammers, stunned him and managed to uh, kill him but I'd already died in those runs, I was just testing. But I also found that if you get under his feet he can one shot you by stomping the ground. So I'm just trying to keep range from him at the moment. Using hammers to stun, get a couple of shots, run away. The plan is to just continue doing that. Hit the hammer, do some damage, run away. And hopefully no more mini adds are around to fuck that up. Of shots. Back the other side. Hammer. All is stunned. He cannot stomp. Two shots. Can't pick my hammer up right now, so I have no way to heal. I realize that at this point, so I'm just trying to get a bit of distance to try and build back up my hammer. And then I go for broke right here, which is a really poor choice. Look at my health, it's almost gone, I got him down. I see I'm getting hit from the right somewhere, I put down a shield, I can't see where he is. I'm getting hit by one leftover ad, my health's almost gone, one more hit from the ad, one other one, I'm dead. Oh... I was stressing when that happened right there, and I could have gone and killed the ad right here, but I was like, fuck it, I'm not gonna risk anything right now, deposit the mode, he'll disappear. <sighs> Fucking did it. <clears throat> See how low my health was at the last second there? Yeah. Oh. 
fuck. Oh my god, that took so long. That's why my 15th attempt. That completion was the fastest one I'd done at 32 minutes. I'd also wiped on that final boss in a, four, in a 50 minute run, a 45 minute run, and a 40 minute one previously. When I completed that, I went and lay on my lounge and stared at the ceiling for about 30 minutes. On the ones that I wiped, I screamed and woke up my poor baby. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you all next time.